Today, we're going to take a quick look at the ins and outs of the progress monitoring tools and SLP toolkit. We have created tests in a variety of skill areas in order to help you track your students' performance on a specific skill. To get started, focus to the student you would like to test and then enter the progress monitoring library. I want to find a test to assess my students' inferencing skills in order to get a baseline score for their new goal. Here we have some different options to choose from, as some of the tests are leveled by grade bands. When you open up a new test, you can begin scoring by simply giving a thumbs up for each correct response or flagging any incorrect responses. Double check to make sure all changes save before exiting. Later in the quarter, I can go back and re-administer this test in order to see progress over the course of this student's IEP. If you ever need to change the date that you administered an assessment, you can do so from the upper left corner. When you administer a test that has pictures, you can use our companion app in order to show your student just the pictures. On a separate device, whether it be a phone or tablet, Log in to viewer.slptoolkit.com to enter your toolkit credentials and view the assessments you have assigned to a student. Now I can score a test while my student focuses solely on the images. Quick tip, you can delete a test run if you don't want to save the current test state. When you do this, the test will still assign itself to the student's profile, but the date will not appear. Another neat thing is that the progress monitoring tools are all customizable. You can create a copy of an existing test and edit it to your liking, or create a brand new test from scratch. After administering a progress monitoring tool, you can download a graph to see how your student is progressing over time. It's that quick and easy, so get ready to save yourself during progress report time and get testing today.